The Sphinx speaks about the new energies. You have all noticed new energies coming in, in reality it is new energies freeing up from what is already present as the Earth itself including your universe is moving through her own path of evolution. What you see as new energies is a release related to clearing and evolution of the planets within your universe as they evolve within including your own planet Earth. This is an evolutionary process that is taking place according to the place and yes time where your universe is moving. This is a process that takes place as there is always movement within your universe as well as outside of your universe. This includes the sun energies and many other energies as everything is always moving inward and outward from a center point called the zero point. Some of you might know that the sun itself seemed to have reached a zero point where the sun flares, sun energies were at a rest point. The sun is reaching her zero point of moving inward and from there her energy will start to move outward again. Every part of your universe will and is going to reach the state of zero point within a short time from now. From there the outward movement will begin again and the next step of evolution of your universe starts. The end of the year 2012 is when your universe and all planets within it reach the ring, or circle where the movement inward can be completed by reaching zero point. This has always been and always will be and it cannot be avoided. It can be interfered with and make the process slower, but it cannot be avoided. What is happening is that within this ring or circle a clearing process takes place and everything within your universe can in this way move through this ring to reach the center of their own zero point. Clearing is needed as the ring itself is something that you can see as contracting the energies. Energies are almost pressed into each other and a clearing allows for release of everything old and not needed. Allowing for the original energies to fully reach their own zero point. This is all separate from the human evolution as the human evolution is a different process within your universe, just as it is a different process for all other races within your universe. You have the option to move within this process of your universe, but it is by choice and your own work within that will allow you to follow this evolutionary process. This also means that you can choose to either go faster or slower than the process that is happening within your universe and with your planet. As humans you have a different energy system, you have lowered part of yourself into a third dimensional energy that allows for a physical appearance upon what seems to you a physical planet and physical universe. This is related to the way your brain works as well as it is related to the way your energy appears or in reality has taken on certain programming to appear physical. The brain works together with the part of you that has taken on, or has lowered itself in a way into the third dimensional appearance of physicality. This also means that parts of you are not even within this universe, or the energies of this universe. This also means that clearings and raising your own human as well as spiritual energies is regulated in a different way. You might have noticed that it is sometimes like your energies or the way you are feeling is going up and down, you work very hard to stay within a balanced place, but this is important to realize, if your energies would have reached a certain point you would not have to work to stay within that place. We will leave it at this for now so you can explore what we have spoken of. <laughs>